Yeah, hello, good day. Um, thank you so much for being a part of this class. My name is Vincent Ayobami Olukoya, popularly known as Otumba. You know, a lot of people, that is what they call me. And why do they um, give me that name, Otumba? Because I'm a smartphone maximization expert. I teach people on how to uh, just make the best use of your phone. So they gave me Otumba of phone user. So, but then, I just had to like, just shorten it as a tumba. So, um, like I already told you on the platform, the app will be making use for the creation of our e-commerce on our phone. It's what Ash, um, you go to your Play Store to download it. This is what you have. You go to your Play Store, you download it. Once you download it, um, this is what you have. Now, an email address will be sent to you, to you for you to verify it. I need to go and verify my email. So now I want to activate my account. Um, redirecting. Okay, just wait a little bit. Once the account is verified, then I think you are good. So now this is what we want to do. The account has been verified. So you have to set up your business. So the first thing you do is add your business details. For some of you that you have your company registered, you can use your business name or your company name. Now at this juncture, please, if you don't have a business name registered with Corporate Affairs Commission, kindly do that. See, it is not wise enough for you to have a name you're using for business and it is not registered. By the time you want to eventually register the name, it is possible someone could have probably um, used that name. And you might think you are still the bona fide owner of the name. No! Even if you've been using the name for the past 10 years and someone just wakes up today and straight up to CAC to register that name, the person that registers it today is the bona fide owner of that name. So please don't joke with that. So now the, first, the next thing you do is you put in your profile image. Um, I'm going to where I have that on my phone my brand name is house of roche so i'm going to where i have that so i'll just go and pick my logo i'm still looking for that but let's no no it is not what i'm looking at for sorry about that please okay I know where I know where I have it. Okay, WhatsApp documents. So that is where I have my logo. So this is my brand logo. I'll pick it. Then cover page as well. The cover page can be picture or we can, it can also be your brand logo that is what i am doing unless i forget if you want to register your company with cac i can help you facilitate that i can help you get that done though so, but if you don't want to patronize or you want to make use of me please you can easily go to whoever wants to help you do that or if you can do that yourself you can go about that so Business name is House of Roche. Then about your business. Basically, um, what we do in House of Roche, it's a fashion designing company and consulting company. Fashion consulting and designing company. We actually help fashion uh, startup fashion designers, um, 
people that are already in business. We help them to legalize their business. We help them with branding. So that aside, please, that is not the purpose of being here. So the business subdomain, I'll put my brand name there, House of Rocher. So the next thing you do is you have a phone number. So I'll have that number. I have that number there now. Then address, that is optional. So the next thing I'll click is click on save. Subdomain, subdomain name has already been taken. I am also the owner of the subdomain name. So I'll just put House of Rocher, double E. Just for the purpose of this class, I'm actually not using that. So this is the first step. Set up business. You're setting up the account. So, so we have that now. So we set up uh, um, we set up our account. So the next thing we will do is for us to add whatever um, e brand products we want to add to our account, to our store. This is what we we'll eventually have at the end of the class. Let me just give you... Um, I just want to open... I know some of you have actually opened the, the site, the let me call it the mini website. This is what we are planning on doing. You can see we have different things there now. This is what we are planning on doing. So in our next video, I'll teach you how to add all this to each category.